Hey everybody, hope you're having a good day. We have finally made it to the final scene in Octane Lighting Essentials Volume 2, and now we have 20 professional lighting studios for Octane Render and Cinema 4D. This is scene number 20, and we're calling it HDRI Generator, and it's a really fun way to create your own custom HDRI maps. All right, so let's fire up a render and we'll see what we have going on here. So we have two different options under this generator. The first one is a sky rig. So you can play around with the north offset of the sun, the sun position, the power, sun intensity, the scale, all the things that you're probably pretty familiar with at this point. But this is a great way to visualize what your HDRI map's gonna look like. And once you have that all dialed in, you can also add clouds and let's tick on clouds here and we'll add those to our scene. And the great thing about these clouds is that they're actually in the 3D space, so they're being affected and lit by this sun. So if we were to change the color of the sky, the color of these clouds is gonna respond appropriately as well. You can change the look of the clouds by using some of these other options for the noise, and you can also increase or decrease the details to make these either thicker or thinner. And you can also use the attenuation. If you drop that slider down, you're gonna have more clouds, and if you increase it, you will have less clouds in your scene. So once you have dialed everything in, all you have to do is go to your render settings, and just change the format to HDR, and then you can render that onto your computer and you have your own beautiful custom HDRI that you can use on any project. If you wanna use this scene to test out the HDRI and see what it looks like, after you render it, just click on Enable Rendering, and under this render twirl down, you can load up that HDRI into this slot right here and then go to your render cam, just check that on. And it's gonna have a little bit of a lighting rig here that you can test your HDRI. All right, so let's go to enable rendering. We'll uncheck that, make sure you're on your HDRI cam and let's look at the studio. So that was the sky rig. You can also do the studio. And we have all of these espresso items that you can change as well. So you can change the amount of lights, the count of them. You can turn off the different style of lights if you only want one. You can uh, not allow or allow overlapping. And under light one, which is this orange one, you can turn off that imperfection. You can see that we have the imperfection around the edges to make it look more realistic. You can also change the color, of course and you can do the same for the other one as well. You can add extra bloom. So it's really easy to play around with all these settings, get a really nice HDRI and render that out. You can start a little collection and use those in future projects. So this is the final scene in Octane Lighting Essentials Volume 2. It's a perfect way to close out this product. And I'm really proud of how this whole thing turned out. 20 incredible professional studio rigs for your next project. I hope you find it useful, and thanks for checking out the Pixel Lab. We'll talk to you next time. Ciao.